Hello, this is Dennis with A1 Telephone Service and Repair, A1 Electronics. You can reach us on the web at www.a1-telephone.com and you can also reach us at 618-235-6959. Today I want to show you a really cool wooden wall crank telephone. This is an American Telephone and Telegraph wooden wall telephone. And this is Robert's Equipment from Alabama. And we want to run through a little bit about what needs to be done since this is the initial checkout. Now, this telephone came in with a lot of the parts off of the telephone. And so what we want to do is troubleshoot our hook switch. We want to install an electronic amplified transmitter that we design and build here at the shop and that will be a high quality transmit power and we also want to go through the magneto we want to make sure that the magneto is producing voltage so we'll troubleshoot that and if we have any issues that will be repaired we also want to try to utilize the original diaphragm style receiver capsule and so we'll take a look at that part of the telephone we also want to replace the cloth cord on this wooden wall crank telephone. We want to rewire this unit the way we want it wired to work the way we want it to work. And we want to install a circuit that we design and build here at the shop that allows you to walk up to the telephone, crank the magneto, and ring the original bells but not backfeed any voltage into the telephone line and yet when you get a call the original bells will ring. Now we also want to install a modular line port so that Robert can simply bring in any length line cord any color he chooses and plug right into that modular port makes for a simple easy plug and play connection. We're going to be installing a keypad in the battery box area and that's cool you'll be able to make a phone call with this telephone we also want to mention that this telephone came in with a number card bracket and we're going to show that in the pictures so that's a plus and that's really cool to have that it's a pretty rare piece and you don't find them very often we're going to go ahead and do some still pictures of this really cool telephone
We have a lot of work that needs to be done. We're going to get a start on this telephone. We'll come back and get some more video as we move forward in the repair and conversion of this really cool wooden wall crank telephone. It's an American telephone and telegraph wooden wall crank telephone. So we'll take a short break and we'll be right back. Okay, we're back now and we are finished up with the repair and conversion of this really cool wooden wall crank telephone and we're ready to start our final checkout. Now we also want to run through a little bit about what went on with this unit. We installed a cloth receiver capsule cord. We also repaired the original diaphragm style receiver so that was taken care of. We went through the solenoids. They needed to be adjusted. We also adjusted the bells. We installed an electronic amplified transmitter that we design and build at the shop and you will have a high quality transmit power. You will not have to get right up on the spit cup and talk into this telephone like you would have had to in the old days. So that was taken care of. We went through the magneto. We went through the wiring. We rewired this unit the way we wanted it wired to work the way we want it to work. We utilized some of the original wiring. We wanted to incorporate some of the original wiring for this telephone into our design. We installed a keypad in the battery box area. We also installed a modular port, a line port, so that Robert can simply bring in any length line cord, any color he chooses, plug right into the modular port, makes for a simple, easy plug and play connection. Now, when you crank the original crank and ring the bells, we installed a circuit that we design here at the shop that allows you to crank the original magneto and ring the bells, but not backfeed any voltage into the telephone line. And yet when you get a call, your original bells will ring. So everything has been worked on on this telephone. Now we also want to mention our amplified pickup. We use this in troubleshooting, repairing, and on our final checkouts. It's amplified so that you can hear the audio from a receiver. Now, since it's an open amplifier, it is prone to any static interference or noise in the atmosphere. And I'm going to go ahead and push the button on our amplifier, and you may hear a little bit of a staticky or electrical hum. I'll release the button. I'll press it one more time. And I'll release it. So if you hear any kind of a electrical hum or static or noise, it will be coming from the amplifier and not the telephone. We want to go ahead and ring the original bells, so we'll crank the magneto. And now what we can do is we can use the analyzer and send a ring cycle like we were getting a call. So we'll start that. We'll let that go a few times. I'll let it go one more time and we'll give you some dial tone. We'll go ahead and hang our unit up. Now what we want to do is go ahead and use our keypad and dial our numbers out but we want to short the transmitter out. If we do not short the transmitter out, we will get a feedback through our transmitter. It's very high quality and it has a high power of transmit. And what will happen is it will cause a feedback in the amplifier. 
So we'll go ahead and plug our line cord in. We access the line. We'll give you some dial tone. And we'll walk through our numbers. If you watch the analyzer, you'll watch the numbers roll by. I'm going to end in a 2. Now I'm going to go ahead and unshort the transmitter. And if you watch that red light on the analyzer, every time you see that red light light up, that's an indication of 100% modulation on transmit. I'm pretty far away from this telephone, and the transmitter is actually pointed in the wrong direction. And you can still see the light on the analyzer is trying to light up. One, two, three, four, five, six. One, two, three, four, five, six. Hello, hello. So we know that this telephone is transmitting. We're going to go ahead and short the line out again, the transmitter. We want to push this button on the switch box. That gives us a line out, totally takes the analyzer out of the situation, and we'll call a time and temp number. We'll give you some dial tone. and we'll make that call. Today is Friday, August 11th. The current time, 7.50 p.m. and the temperature, 77 degrees. We'll go ahead and pull our line on our line cord and we'll give you some dial tone. We'll plug it back in. We'll call my number and it'll be busy. Now that we know that this really cool American telephone and telegraph wooden wall crank telephone has been repaired and converted, we can return it to Robert and he can enjoy this telephone. I'm sure it's going to look great no matter where it's installed. This is Dennis with A1 Telephone Service and Repair, A1 Electronics. You can reach us on the web at www.a1-telephone.com. And you can also reach us at 618-235-6959. Thank you for watching and have a great day.